Uh, my name is Ryan Payne. I'm an advisor and organizer for Operation Mutual Aid, a national organization of militia and patriotic citizens who have taken a pledge to stand between tyrants and the oppressed. And uh, I've also been designated by Clive and Bundy as uh, his representative to the militias. Okay, so how long have you guys been out here so far? Uh, myself and another gentleman from my local unit, the West Mountain Rangers, Montana, out of uh, Southwest Montana. We arrived on Tuesday morning at 7:30. And have you had to? What have you been doing so far? Just kind of setting up camp, or? Uh, w when I first arrived, Cliven was just glad to see somebody that wasn't afraid to to carry a firearm around, and uh, he's kept me pretty close to the hip ever since then. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, these guys aren't scared. They just understand the inevitable situation that they're in, uh, based on history and how the uh, the authorities act in all of these situations. Mm -hmm. And and since then, I've been coordinating uh, with militia across the country to uh, uh, support their movement to this location uh, in order to meet the Bundy and the militia community's objectives. You have some more questions? Yeah. Um, Sorry. So, we're talking about. Uh, but this is a bigger issue. I mean, a lot of people are taking it as a bigger issue. So, if you maybe comment on what. Uh... Well, the issue here, I think everybody's pretty aware, is the defense of liberty. And uh, these people's safety has been violated. These people's. Uh, and actually, I, I want to quote Mr. Bundy. Hey, hold on on the hammering. <laughs> uh, I want to quote Mr. Bundy at the town hall in Overton the other night. Uh, he said that the goal here is to restore the Bundy and the public's families' rights to life, liberty, and property. Their lives ha have been greatly affected by this. They have incurred, uh, uh, you know, physical injury uh, because of their stand. Uh, their their liberty to use the land that they've possessed, their family has possessed water rights to for the past 120 years has been infringed. And the public's access, especially the people of Clark County, has been infringed to these public lands. And uh, uh, their property has been stolen by the federal government. And, uh, and all, all three of those things need to be restored. That is their pledge to, to pursue the restorance of that. And uh, Operation Mutual Aid uh, is gonna do everything in our efforts to uh, facilitate the, the patriots from all over the community supporting that. So you would say this is Clive and, not Clive and Bundy versus the BLM. This is really him just doing this for us, so to say. This is the public body. It's much bigger than him. Yes, and, and he's very aware of the impact that all of this has, uh, as are all of us. Um, one thing I want everybody to know, uh, the, the character of this man is, is unmatched. The things that I've heard him say, the private conversations that I've had with him, um, this man is uh, likened to George Washington in my eyes, um, and, and I say that as no small, small statement. Um, they're a deeply religious family, a uh, very large family, and very cohesive. And uh, they will not stop until, uh, until they've restored their right to life, liberty, and property. How do you see this turning out? Uh, I, I don't want to make any premonitions as to how this is going to turn out. That's in God's hands. Um, but I will say that what we want to see is the uh, everyone leave here safely. And in order to do that, the public land must be restored to the public. And the property of the Bundys that has been confiscated must be returned to them. I have a, we, we interviewed some of the people down there. And a lot of them were concerned, too, that uh, the representatives weren't showing up. You know, right. Um, yeah, and, and the response has been uh, a lot better from people just coming here to support the Bundys by physically being here. Mm -hmm. um, and, and now we've got uh, dedicated men, as I said before, that have vowed to place themselves in between uh, the citizens that have showed up to support the Bundys and the people that have threatened their lives. Thank you. What, what would you say to the people out there who are saying that the Bundys are trespassing on federal land? What do you have to say? That's what, Even Senator Harry Reid came out and said that. He's the, defending the BLM. Yes. The Supreme Court has ruled that the citizens are the sovereign in America. The state is not the sovereign. The federal government is not the sovereign. The citizen is the sovereign. You can't trespass on the citizen. Thank you, Thank you very much. Thank you.